A little over a year ago, I was in a place in my life where I felt like a complete bitch. I was doing all the wrong habits, doing nothing productive, playing video games, and just felt like a complete loser. However, I just started doing some of the right habits, and over the course of the year, I have disciplined myself a lot. One of the main reasons I struggled was due to a lack of masculine qualities. I didn't possess the traits I needed to to become my best self. But as soon as I started to implement the things I'm going to teach you in this video, everything changed. My name is Frank. I help young men through self-improvement. If that interests you, go click the subscribe button so more young men can also see these videos. The first masculine quality we're going to talk about is discipline, and this is the foundation for everything. Discipline is doing the hard work, doing the hard things, even in moments when you don't feel like it. For example, if you're disciplined, you don't wake up on a day you're supposed to go work out and just lay in bed and scroll on social media and then play video games. No, you get up and you go to the gym. You get up and you do the good habits that you need to do. Because the truth is, there are going to be days that you don't feel like doing the things you need to do. But Regardless of that, you have to do it because somewhere out there, there is a guy who is doing the hard work, who's doing things he needs to do, and he's gonna take what's yours. He's gonna take what you want if you don't do that as well. Quality number two is weightlifting. Look, bro, it doesn't matter how mentally strong you are. It doesn't matter what other traits you have if you don't build the physique, if you don't build a masculine build. I absolutely think the other kinds of fitness like running, cardio, that, yeah, that's all important, but you still have to do the weightlifting. You still have to, you know, put on size because you, you, you know, you can say it's shallow, you can say whatever you want, but people are judging you based on appearance. So you want to put on size, you want to get bigger. Quality number three is stoicism. Stoicism is essentially being able to control your emotions, not letting your emotions control you. Because think about it, think about the guy who, and this is like a lot, me when I was younger, I used to, you know, someone would make fun of me or, you know, I'd be on a date and a girl would kind of start to test me and say, oh, you know, I think that, I think that's an ugly shirt you're wearing. And I would just freak out and, you know, get, get all offended. But the truth is, is that you can't let what other people say. You can't let what other people do or circumstances in life control your emotional state. You want to focus on what you are doing because the truth is life is going to throw a lot of hard things your way. It's going to throw you a lot of battles and through all that, you have to maintain a level head. And by the way, this also applies to good things because you're going to have moments where you're going to make some progress. You're going to, you know, and then you're going to get a bit complacent. You're going to feel like cheating on your diet a bit more because you finally made some gains. You're going to feel like, you know, sleeping in a bit because you finally started to make progress on your business. But you just cannot do that because it's so important. You keep putting in the work and getting better because if you're not getting better, you're getting worse. Quality number four is no fap. And look, I'm not going to talk about this too much because I'm sure you've watched, you know, a million videos on it. But just don't watch things you shouldn't be watching. You know, don't jerk off. It just... It makes you feel like a loser, right? Because, you know, when, when, when you jack off and then you go out in the world, you just feel like a goblin. You feel like, you know, a, a weird guy who does things that he shouldn't be doing because it brings down your vibrational state, right? You want to be in a state of high vibration where you feel like you're doing all the right things because this will lead to you actually taking better actions as well and being better on your self-improvement. So just do NoFab. It's good for you. And number five is community. You want to be around other like-minded masculine men. And the quickest way you can do this is go join a sports team, join a martial arts club, find a group of guys you can go and lift with. You want to have other like-minded men because the truth is friends, having a community is absolutely important. You want to be surrounded by men who are trying to achieve similar things. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to click the like and subscribe button and comment so more young men can get on self-improvement and become better members of society. Love you, bro.